right move. Okay. Um, he's not fast. He can do 56 plus electric touch. He's still dazed. He's almost dead. If I... He can't kill me in one hit. Not with GDR. There we go. Not with GDR plus Arlek. There's our scroll of blinking. Let's stop making uh, horribly bad choices, yeah? That whole Pan Lord fight was uh, badly done. Yeah, well, it's not just Tango. I'm also misplaying quite a bit. But yeah, with the low HP and just the way this character is built... Uh, there's going to be a lot of that unless I play with extreme caution, and essentially I've just not been doing that. Gotta be more careful, man. He gave you the lag spell? Great. Have fun. Having 30 minutes added to your game. Wow, another Panlord floor. Got to be shitting me. Ooh, Orb of Destruction too? Hey, we're lagging. Oh man, the Ice Fiend didn't die instantly. Okay, um... Orb of Electricity could be easily re-added if you wanted. You could. I'm not, I'm not sure if it really needs to exist in a world that uh, has Conjure Ball Lightning. I mean, is there a purpose? Resistant to fire and cold. Um, no AC, though, so it's definitely correct to firestorm him and maybe uh, irradiate him to death, except the fact that we really don't want to be Orb of Destruction. Yeah, it did used to be a player spell. Tremor Stones would actually do well against him. He didn't want to die, but that's okay. Whoa! That... That was a miss, that was a miss, uh, I fat fingered the keyboard. There we go. Okay, can this, can this, uh, can this ziggurat stop throwing panlords at me? We're only on zig four, you guys. Uh, yeah, OD versus Firestorm Fire is cool. Oh boy, let me pick up the bog. Oh boy. Sheep are scaring the shit out of me a bit. But yeah, this is all my fault. I've memed myself by trying to get Air Magic 27 instead of going for defenses. I'm really just uh, being cute for the sake of Twitch chat here. It's a big electric fireball. I mean, that sounds pretty cool. It kind of still exists in the game in the form of um, Mock Lab Grader, whatever. Another one! Bro, and he has Orb of Destruction and he has Haste, but he's not resistant to fire, so we should just be able to GG him at about five seconds. I'm sorry, what? Oh, okay. That's how we're going to play it, huh, Mr. Tormentor? This should kill him. Goodbye, Gabula Gablu Glax. Gablu Gax. Goodbye, Gary Gygax. R.I.P. Taken too soon, etc., etc. Plog champ. <laughs> oh, yes. No, well, we're getting some more AC. Did 
down to Zot 6, or zig Ziggurat 6, I should say. God, another one? Wow, and they're crystal statues too. <laughs> okay, um... Weird to go for Tornado before maxing spellcasting? Yeah. I, I'm just memeing here, basically. Uh, it's not correct. I'm not going to pretend that it's correct. But I'm committed now. I've got to. I've got to have it, you guys. It's a lot of ranged here. Why don't I just make my life easier and make them come to me? I want that tornado, you guys. I gotta have it. No, this is not optimal. Um, the optimal thing to do would be to get defenses, and then possibly some more spell casting after that. At least get airstrike. Uh, yeah, we, we could. Um, I'm afraid I've left my amnesia outside, though. It would actually be a reasonable way to kill Orbs of Fire, I suppose. Actually, a pretty good way. We have absolute zero, and we have shatter. Time to master all four magics. <laughs> That's right. Firestorm clears floors pretty damn fast, I have to say. Uh, we did, Tony. We absolutely did. Champion tier, right? Let's get C-Blink online. I'll get right on that. It's a really good idea. I think that spell is uh, <laughs> just great. <laughs> and definitely in this version. this? Where's my uh, potions of experience? Usually I would have found some by now. Only one blink, too. Oh, uh, you did not? I thought you were trolling me. Yeah, they took out they took out that spell. The second acquirement, that's true. What if that trove has exactly what we need? I mean, we don't need anything, we just need consumables, really. Uh, or we'd like consumables, and we'd like for me to stop misplaying everything. This has been the most flubbed game of Crawl, I think, that I have ever played. However, Ignition just kind of turns off these floors. Also, we're getting a ton of gold, which is great. Um, that's the other thing about doing floors of ziggurats as it goes, ag guy. Um, you're just kind of gaining power. Although we're on zig 11 now, so it's probably time for me to bail. Um, maybe one more. 
Don't get lured into doing one more and then dying, though. We, uh, alright, we have Holy Word, we have Blink. Right now, if we got a Panlord floor and enough Panlords, or enough Ghosts even, I don't know if the Holy Word would be enough to save me. On the other hand, we have Haste, we have, we have Gozak Potion Petition. Um, how bad could it be? Even if it was a mummy floor, we could just go tree form probably and ignite a lot. I could see this turning into a really bad situation though. I think it's time to bail. God, I can't believe that entrance to Zot with the Quicksilver Dragon. Uh, hey, these, ooh, two Blink Scrolls. Quicksilver Dragon and the, the Orb of Fire, which we still haven't dealt with, by the way. Trove has Orange Crystal Plate. Well, we're never going to find out unless we find another requirement. But anyway, we have Blink again, so... Oh, right, this is the Acid Floor. We really got dabbed on a bit here, didn't we? By getting Acid Floor... Uh, plus... Plus Early Orb of Fire... Plus Quick Surfer Dragon all in the same place. Come on, more Orbs of Fire, no! No, Tornado's at 47%. You would think it would be online, but I'm afraid that there is no such luck. God has turned his back on this front. Well, I am wearing rather heavy armor. Pearl Dragon Scales is one of those things where you think it's light, and it is light, but it's actually what's well, technically classified as medium. It's just lighter than you would expect it to be for how good it is. Um, so, I mean, let's be honest. I'm I'm casting level nine magic in in medium armor. I can't I can't complain about the uncastability of it. Why is my why is my firestorm Hold on. Why is it eleven percent? I swear it was nine percent a minute ago. It's fourteen because I uh because I'm not wearing my plus two int ring. But I, I, we lost some some percentage points there and I'm not sure how. Bet you forgot we had the lag spell. Oh, hello. Hello, dickhead. Drink magic. Alright, if I do nothing but irradiate, he dies. I don't care if I get... I don't care if I get, uh, contaminated. We're not, we're not fooling around anymore. Uh, you cannot really be... Yeah, he can't. Can't really be hexed, because he's purple. I've had it with this. I'm irradiating again. Oh, for Jesus. Okay. Uh, hi, guys. Heal wounds. I have so many heal wounds. Yeah, okay, so I, I say that as a joke. I had this landlord once who... I don't know why I picked this up, and I really wish I hadn't. But this dude, um, I had this, I had this, I had this landlord who... Okay, so I had a, I had a roommate who was, like, random, randomly assigned... And um, he just kind of split on his bail, or on his bail, on his uh, on his rent. He still had unpaid rent. He just left. 
And uh, so the landlord shows up, or some representative of the company, and he's going through the guy's stuff, basically impounding the big ticket items that are worth money to, to pay for his rent, because he just left all of his shit there. And as he's grabbing everything, I guess it was like a mess uh, in the dude's in the dude's bedroom, I hear him going, oh, for Jesus, like, like every five seconds. And... It was so funny to me that, like, for a whole semester, my, my remaining u- roommates and I, like, repeated that over and over. And somehow this became part of what I say sometimes. Uh, it's really, really probably not the best. Um, but yeah, I did not expect a giant crowd of draconians around that corner. Okay, you are, you are charmed. Good story. I don't know, just I found that so amusing, that phrasing. I'd never heard anybody say that before. Malcolm Lore. <laughs> it's like it's what what a what a weird expletive, you know? You know? <laughs> it's just like it's really strange. He was very surprised. Maybe, maybe he was just declaring that uh, he was cleaning up for Jesus. He was doing it, you know, for him. We'll keep uh, chilling out near this staircase and basically being a gigantic coward because this floor scares the hell out of me. I'm a guy with Firestorm online and I, I don't feel like we can safely... Look at that! Motherfucker! Did we just take 100 damage over the course of that turn? Let's take a look at the combat log. This is all one turn. So first I miscast Firestorm. I take two exclamation points worth of damage. Uh, I get Kaz Loud by the Stormcaller. Blast Vice hits me. Two exclamation points. Or excuse me, just one. Um, by the way, fun fact, I think this is just straight damage. Not fire damage. Just straight damage. Doesn't care about my resist. Then uh, we get Hellfired for three exclamation points. That is that is really something. Yeah, I should I should have said for Jesus. <laughs> this is uh, what you might call a little bit of horse shit. I am so tired of miscasts. I mean, look, I'll be honest. I am casting Firestorm with thirteen percent fail rate, which is you know not ideal, but. Oh, we have a ton of bad mutations. I should have checked those. If we had gotten minus scrolls there, that would have been amazingly bad. Amazingly bad. Actually, my spells are easier to cast, but a little less powerful, so comically... <laughs> Time to swap to Salamander Hide. Mm, yes, that will fix my problems. I'm going to drink one of these. I have 13. Actually, I'm going to drink a few. All right, that's much better. We have more int now. And by the way, that's that's where my fail rate was coming from, was int getting reduced. Oh, for Jesus. Firestorm will drop to 0%. I think not. No, we just have to stop using Firestorm. I'm being very silly by trying to use it. In fact, I'm going to stop uh, memeing and trying to get air online. We're going to... We're going to stop being dumb, basically. Stop fooling around. Uh... Defense, defense, let's see, what can I do to kill Orbs of Fire with my current tool set? Okay, we're gonna get, we're gonna go ahead and uh, get Airstrike online, so this is not completely useless, the uh, training. I don't need Fulminate Prism anymore. Time to, time to uncuck this run. Um, is there anything else? Yes, that's correct, Green Eggs and Slam, unless you... Enjoy losing runs. Okay. Um, there is blink available.
Um, I don't think there's a situation where I really need Starburst. Actually, I don't need Contra Flame. There we go. Blink. Okay. Now, what do we train? Um, defenses, or do we get spell casting? We're going to get spell casting, because maybe at some point I can get these things online by the end of Zod. I doubt it, but it's possible. But it's going to help with everything, really. We're also going to take some T-Lokes. Take it to five. It's almost no experience. Take you up. Radiate's still doing some work. Wow, there was a Death Drake hiding there. That's okay. We're going to do this. Which killed his minions, but not him. We're going to Fireball. He has... Yeah, he's almost dead, so boom. Go up. Radiate. Okay. That doesn't exist anymore. They made it far less interesting, I suppose. Everything must be homogenized. Do we still have blink? We still have two blinks, so... This looks bad, but it's really not that bad. Dragon out of the way. Okay. It'd be very embarrassing to splat and zot at the end of a 60 streak, don't you think? I couldn't possibly blame RNG. Well, unless it was like a wacky killer clown situation, perhaps. I gotta be able to blame the RNG. Oh wait, we're not, we're not casting Firestorm. They named it Team Splat, that's true, they did. Maybe that's, maybe that's why. Maybe that's why we're having trouble this tournament. <laughs> We've tempted fate. With the poor naming choice. Okay, forget you. Now I'm okay with firestorming. I threw it away dying to something dumb. Well, that is... That is how runs in DCSS often go, unless you play with just extraordinary caution, and maybe in, maybe maybe even maybe even if you are being cautious. Let's rest. Hello, asshole, Mr. Quicksilver Dragon. All right, that's it. Um, not quite a kill hole, but it'll do. Fragile little Tingu. You know what I'd really like? I'd like a more. I'd like more digging. And there is digging for sale here, actually, uh, that I completely neglected. So let's grab that. We're gonna full clear. This is. Uh, this is not the character where we can fool around and not fool clear Zot and feel safe about it. This is probably the uh, most fragile character we've played at this point. Immediate surround. Holy crap, that's nerfed. Although, I do need a little more transmutations, I suppose. here would be poetic. Would it? It says Irradiate has 38% power, so...
The streak began with a Tengu Conjure. Oh, I see. Yeah, that's true. Okay, that was a really irritating surround. We could either irradiate here or we could ignition, which I think the ignition would do more damage. Okay, maybe not anymore. Let's do this. How much mana we have? 44. How luxurious compared to the 35 we had a minute ago from our mutations. I am going to burn a Firestorm, perhaps against my better judgment, and now I have learned that Firestorm will not go through walls, even though it says that it will. If I cast Firestorm here, even though you see yellow up here, it just won't land on him. Thank you, game. Very good programming. Uh... Thankfully, Fireball is uh, hilariously strong versus things that don't have RF. <laughs> Even at this late juncture. Wow, you want to berserk my shock bat? My shock bat beast? You, you just have a grand old time doing that. Did you know that I didn't know that Moths of Wrath were fast? All this time, I thought they were speed 10. Suppose that explains a bit. around with clowns. I would have loved to have just dumped a firestorm there, but it was our firestorm by the way. 7%. This is going to be significantly less crappy. Hello. much damage possible here. That's an Annihilator, but he's uh, he's too far away to really cause an issue, so... Lightning rod. Nice. Yeah, basically, it's okay for me to cast Firestorm as long as I have about. I just have to assume I have about 50 less HP than I actually have. It would be really nice if I knew exactly how much damage that miscast should do or could, can, can do maximum. But essentially, I, I can't be casting that, even, even into a giant crowd of uh, Draconians. Uh, as cool as it is to do that, uh, I can't do it safely if they have a Scorcher or something with them. Anything that can hit me from like a really long range... Is fine. We can we can work around that. Plus ignition is probably better in that situation anyway. I'm just getting highway blind here, basically trying to go at full speed uh, in places where I shouldn't. One would think that I would just be like erasing. Uh, draconian packs by tabbing into them with this weapon, but simple fact is our defenses just aren't good enough. Be 
because I foolishly dumped experience into air instead of getting defenses like I should have. Oh, okay, let's be careful here. Do you guys see why I don't play Tengus, by the way? <laughs> Something about playing a Tengu just, like, encourages me to play like shit. It's very, it's very weird. Just like, seeing the little, uh, just like seeing the uh, little Tengu at the top right turns my brain off entirely. Now let's bail uh, downwards. We're okay in melee against, like, single targets. Tengu moves faster, so you must play faster. Ah, yes. Genius. Well, we're not speed 11 anymore. I stopped flying. Oh, I didn't stop flying. I should stop flying. The airstrike is in here. Even if it does give me EV, it's not, it's not correct. Based, 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 based. Let's go up. But yeah, um, irradiate, I think, is still a reasonable prob problem solver. It's just you can't... Uh, I mean, you could use it as a main way of doing damage, but you just can't use it as a reliable thing anymore. I think that's my final opinion on it. Shit. We can't do this. Uh, I may end up blinking from this shit. Um, flying. Your AC is good, but your... well, actually your AC is reduced, and you're flying. So... Okay, that worked out. Airstrike did a little less than I thought it would, but... these nice easy draconian packs on Zot 1. Just like basic bitch draconians instead of the the murder squads that showed up to own me. With their orb of fire support. <laughs> they switched one and four. I mean this is I'm like coming down here and getting snuggled by a pack of kittens, you know? Nah, it's just RNG. It's just, just how Zot works. Um, this is a particularly egregious example of it happening. It's fine. Um, I think at this point of the game you can kind of sort of throw balance to the wind as long as things aren't too RNG and just uh, force the player to deal with it. But the Zot 5 that was one, one tiny room, yeah. Oh, lag. All right, we're on the final floor of the game. How about we take this very carefully? Aw, 
I wanted to I wanted to get a uh, Wormbane stab on him. Well, not really a stab, but you know. Yeah, let's not Firestorm. Remember what I said about not doing that near a Scorcher who can do a bunch of damage to me? When he has backup as well. Drink attention, go bigger, go home. Mm, yes. We will get the friend here in a moment. Um, hey, these guys don't fly anymore. I thought that all Draconians and Zot flied. I shouldn't have airstruck them. It's crazy because, um, you know, we have resistances, but we're taking a shocking amount of damage from fire just on account of... I mean, it's funny because 32 isn't exactly anything to sneeze at when it comes to AC, but we're still taking a bunch of damage. It's kind of weird, actually. Maybe 40 is the magic number with resistances. It's just it's strange to watch my character taking damage from fire, uh, draconian fire breath. But then again, that's, that's 3D uh, 20. So they max roll 60, it gets uh, halved, halved and then reduced a little more because of uh, two pips instead of one. I guess it could technically still do like 20, 25 damage maybe. Four percent firestorm, thirteen percent tornado. We we could we could get some tornado action on now and feel not so bad about it. Where's the best friend? Only 15,000 turns left in depths. I better be careful, bros. Okay, um, hello, best friend. Please, please join me going up the staircase. Please join me on our miraculous and friendly voyage journey whatever you want to call it, uh, up, up the stairs, and then back down the stairs. We're going to call this, it's a new anime called Convoker's Magical Journey of Friendship. It's going to have like an intro theme song uh, sung by a 10 year old girl, like all animes do. 100% of animes. Okay, um... Keep going down. This character probably should have taken the time to get Garyon's uh, horn. I suppose I might still do that, maybe not. A longer title. Ah, uh, yes. What? Oh no, I lost my friend. He went into a teleport trap. I thought the Zot 5 lungs were bullshit until I made a very unusual friend. <laughs> Did you know that Garyon... Did you know that uh, he doesn't have any fire resistance? But even so, he doesn't seem to want to die. And I've successfully called this entire floor with all the noise I'm making. I don't think we're going to have time to grab it uh, without fighting the rest of the floor. Oh, I'm out of here. There's a Tormentor. Now I'm done. Yes, yes, yes. 
even going up might have been a mistake there. All right, failed. I should have invised probably. Let's find our friend. friend. Wanted to make sure that I hadn't missed any shields. Um, how about hats? No. All right, we should be we should be okay on equipment. Oh, you know what I forgot to do? I forgot to. I'll do it afterwards. I, I keep forgetting to get the acquirement. We're not going to find two acquirement apparently. So I should just use that one for gold, I guess. Technically, we could just. Um, could just bribes up five right now, but no. <laughs> Wait a minute, this is great. This is perfect, actually. This is the perfect layout, bro. Have fun, yeah, yeah, summon stuff. He can't summon too many things. We take him up. Oh my god, this is ideal. Are you kidding me? We just have him take a little best friend nap. Um Thanks, crawl devs. This is intended, right? Somebody hellfires him to death. Yeah, because of the bug. I give you, my friends, the safest way to do Zot 5. <laughs> Alright, this is a little bit annoying. If I go back down, I could get LCS for an awful lot of damage. Um, no, we'll be fine. Because we have silence. By the way, he didn't come up with me for some reason. Yeah. He didn't want to come up. How curious. So he was summoning when I last saw him. It looks like going upstairs breaks the summon. That's right. Oh, he. Oh, hey! You called it, bro! The bug is still here. They do get a free action the first turn uh, that they're summoned. And so, as a result, there it is. Wait a minute. I silenced, but I need to check something. Yeah, affected by silence. Glad they haven't bothered to fix that. Really, really competent and uh, prolific work on the part of the crawl devs. This is the this is the best convoker trick we have ever pulled. Oh, it's beautiful. I hadn't even considered how much this type of layout would solve the problem of, you know, things getting surround on you and getting an automatic move. Um, honestly, it'll probably be some completely lazy solution, like just making Convokers not able to do anything outside of their branch. Which is funny, because that's going to screw over Convokers and... Uh, that have spawned sort of randomly in other branches, like like shapeshifter convokers and things. Um, they instantly die when they go to the top five. Yeah, okay, here's the, here's the comically bad idea that they're going to implement. They're going to simply make convokers not cast the spell, but only on Zot 5. <laughs> Couldn't you guys see that happening? It's not any less lazy than... Uh, or it's not any more lazy than their solution to the um, Deep Elf Death Mage problem. They 
respect the orb too much. Ah, uh, yeah. Convokers turn into Pan Lords on Zot 5. You just die instantly if a Convoker goes to Zot 5. Oh, uh, Deep Off Death Mage had a spell called Twisted Resurrection, which was actually an old spell that the player used to have. Very cool spell. Arguably a bit degenerate to use, and by that I mean it uh, it kind of encourages you to farm a lot. Uh, as you probably know, it's the thing that uh, it's it's the it's the thing that turns corpses into permanent abomination allies. So uh, the thing that you used to be able to do with them, which I, I think I was the one who discovered, um, you can use Redemnul's enslave uh, ability to get one of those guys, um, and then you can have abominations as allies forever. Uh, and it's super, super cool. Not, I wouldn't say that it's broken. Uh, it's just kind of cool. So there's a solution to that. Instead of taking the spell out, which was probably what should have happened, uh, because there's various reasons why the spell is annoying. Uh, kind of encourages the, the player to, every time he sees a death mage, to wander away and wait for corpses to decay. Um, and back, back when there was butchering, it encouraged people to butcher corpses. Uh, even if they were mummies or something. But no, they didn't remove the spell. They simply made it not get cast if you enslave uh, a death mage. Which, personally, I think is a bit silly. Just a bit. Oh, that's right. It's condenser time. It's, yeah, well, yeah, it is maddening. It doesn't make sense, does it, Tony? It does not make sense. Unethical. <laughs> I don't know if... <laughs> I don't think it's unethical, but it's, uh, it's just bad. It's like a bad way to solve the problem if you even think that there's a problem there. Personally, um, I think that spell is hilariously fun. And the fact that you can jankily get a hold of it, or at least you used to be able to, um, was just fine. I just don't understand the universe where they, they think it's a problem that the player can get a hold of it, but they think it's okay for it to exist as a monster spell. Triple 27, yeah, baby. Don't see that often in a, in a character that hasn't farmed at all. Also, we have a maxed out... Um, we have a maxed out... Pearl Dragon armor now, so I can stop picking up Enchant armor. Plus 10, baby. Don't see that often either. See, there it is. If we had if we had been out in the open, we could have gotten lcs and double fireballed. But as it stands, we're just uh, we're just uh, balling, basically. It can't do anything to me. Of course, this is kind of annoying that this got set up this way. I don't know how I'm going to go back down and safely deal with this problem. I guess I might go to a different staircase. No, we don't want to... Oh, we could, actually. We could airstrike. I am afraid that that bug with Hellfire is more overarching than I think it is, and that these guys are just going to sort of uh, explode on top of my... my uh, he, they're going to murder the Convoker and not care, and then proceed to make a million damage happen to me. I, I suppose that I could... Uh, let's drink a resist and see what happens. Give us something to complain about. <laughs> oh, would it? I'm going to try to melee this guy. With might. Actually, I, I could airstrike him. I wonder... Yeah, airstrike just doesn't do a whole lot of damage. Even against them. It worked, I suppose, but... Anyway, we're frail now. Uh, let's see, there's a lich and an, and an orb. It's time to use Potion Petition for haste. Paralyze the Convoker first so the orb couldn't switch places. I could have done that. I was actually kind of wanting them to switch places so I could pull up. I didn't think the airstrike plan would work. I think I thought that they would just start like exploding on him. However, that that was um, 
I suppose that was probably worth testing, huh? Anyway, we're hasted. Uh, we don't have resistance anymore. Let's do that again. Uh, and we're gonna, we're actually, we're gonna silence so that I can't get memed on and we can just cancel out of the silence if need be. Let's drink, uh, we're already mined, we don't need to drink mine. Let's go down. Okay, let's find out. Let's, let's test it. He's paralyzed. I'm gonna wait a couple turns. God damn, I think you're right. I can't cast anything because of silence, but... Yeah, they're not doing anything. I'm waiting turns and nothing's happening. I should be attacking. Wait a minute, I shouldn't be attacking. I can accidentally hit my boy here. Yeah, I don't know how that works. Green X and Slam. Once the silence is over... Hey, Senshi, how you doing, buddy? This is so weird. This is hilarious. Still silenced. Throw a bottle of water at him. <laughs> mm. You know, we could we could phantom mirror. That'd be kind of funny. Okay, we're no longer silenced. Alright, here we go. Uh we could net the Convoker. Uh, we could, but it would be less reliable because he could jump out of it at any moment. Look how long the airstrike is going to take to kill him. Oh, wait, it's actually doing okay. Your old account for DCSS can't launch any games, but if I make a new account, I can. Um, that sounds like a bug with the server, so I would contact whoever runs the server and ask them about that, because that's um, that should be something that they can fix. Paralysis. Paralysis. Okay, no more paralysis. They swap places. We, um, I didn't bother to look at what spells my, my copy my copy was casting. Uh, that is true, Tony. It will work. <laughs> they are flying, it's just that their AC is very high, so it takes it takes a lot of tries. I think that was back when I was playing a lot of summoners. Um, it's a lot easier when you have summoners to absorb uh, to, to kind of get you some turns. Also, the you could use the the old Lightning Spire trick. You're not the only one having this issue. Interesting. I'm trying to see if if the the lich copy cast any spells okay there's the lich doing stuff uh okay i mirrored him there he's touching the other lich a lot crystal spear crystal spear we have to read silence Let's stop fucking about. Um, what's the chance of acid hitting? There we go. Would not want to eat two crystal spears. So this still comes with its dangers, this whole thing that I'm doing. But, but, but man, it is uh, it is safer than, than Zot 5 the normal way. also just a great moment. It really is. Uh, these are our skills, Senshi. We have 327s. That's true. There's the Torment. Torment's okay in this situation, though. It's 
maybe less okay in the context of a uh, yeah I could be I could be owned here uh, let's fog so I can't see that guy if I can't see him then that means that uh, he can't hurt me right feels like line sprint now it really does I forget are they resistant to fire they're immune to fire. Mm, yes, okay. Uh, fuck it. Okay, I don't know. You know what? I gotta stop screwing around with this because um, I don't know how much damage the miscast can do. Why would an undead toe be immune to fire? I don't know, because the devs are dumb. Not immune to air. Well, they don't. Uh, they don't fly. So, oh, they do fly. How did I forget that they fly? Curious. Let's condense her. Nice. They're not immune to acid. Now I can airstrike for an enormous amount of damage. See how his AC goes down to only four pips. It's the same as an orb of fire, I suppose. Whoops. Uh, I'm just gonna keep training spell casting. Actually, we're gonna. <laughs> We're going to do what we should have done a million years ago. <laughs> Take armor and dodging to 15, perhaps. Whoops, I didn't mean to cast that spell. I, n I meant to cast airstrike. Oh, um, here's a downside. He can uh, he can might orb guardians, which can be pretty painful for for dudes with uh, low AC. He can also might these guys, which is less annoying. Sorry for hurting you, my convoker friend. Have we cleared the floor? He doesn't want to summon anymore, so I think we've killed every single sentient thing on the floor. The only thing that'll be left is dragons. Who are considered animals, I think. I could be wrong about that. Sorry, best friend, you've been turned into coins, Mario style. Okay, so there's an animal. I must do this with melee only. Well, I don't know if I can, there's a ghost moth. We'll try. We'll try for fun. Uh oh, there's these guys too. Test right. I have become the Tingu Knight. Here's my my nemesis here. Quicksilver dragons really are no joke. Hey guys, there's not much in these lungs. What's going on? I guess the game bugged. There's uh there's just not much in these lungs today. Seems really barren in here for some reason. How strange. Right, let's win this damn game, yeah? Read Telly. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, grab. We immediately Telly. After all that bad luck in the ziggurat with regards to with with regards to pan lords, maybe we can have some luck here. I'm actually gonna firestorm this guy. He'll die in one hit. Hopefully he didn't, but that's okay. We have fireball to bail us out, and he didn't torment me, so I'm happy. Hey, Gray Burden, you missed um, probably the most exciting thing I've ever done in DCSS. We discovered that a hallway plus staircase is the ultimate situation. For the, con for the Convoker Friend strategy. If I go invis here, he can't torment me. I could have just irradiated, but not guaranteed. How about you? Are you? Yeah, you're immune to fire. That damage is fine. 
<laughs> yeah, I really didn't expect that. I thought they would try to bolt through him, especially considering that his, H his HD is not that amazing, but also because of the various bugs related to that that have cropped up recently. Oh god. You would be surprised how annoying Hellwings are on the orb run. Sometimes. Actually, you know what I should do? I should probably, uh... I should probably bribe Branch, huh? <laughs> That's right. It's all about that tornado, man. Greed is good. Okay, that's a Hellion. Um, he did not die to Firestorm. I am just as fast as that Tormentor, and he spawned at the edge of line of sight, so we simply walk away. Yeah, no pan lords at all. Kind of cool. G G, Dingu Fire Elementalist. Only nine more games to go until we get to the proper number of wins. Very very lengthy game. However, a uh, very fun game. I killed all the pan lords. Yeah, that in the ziggurat they uh, should we get absolute zero online next. I could play an ice elementalist, I suppose. I'm sure that it will be less miserable. Than, uh, than Fire Elementalist currently is. Maybe we could play a Merfolk Ice Elementalist. We'll see. But if I were to start a new game right now, I would certainly make some kind of horrible mistake and die, so let's not do that. Let's call it a night. I do hope you guys enjoyed the stream. Thank you for coming by. Until next time, I am signing out. Did you know that there are many ways that you can help support this channel? Read about them on rosecrypto.com support. At Rosecrypto, you can learn all about cool things like the Brave web browser, Bitcoin, and other cryptocurrencies. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like and subscribe.